another episode and if you're new here, welcome as well. Today I'm going to be running you through our core off-road canopy which we had installed right at their factory in Perth. We actually drove all the way from the other side of the country to have this canopy done and I'm going to show you exactly why and maybe I can convince you to get one as well. They're bloody amazing, I'll tell you what. So let's take a look inside. Alrighty, so we open her up and the first thing I am drawn to is the beer safe. So we've actually had this sticker put on our fridge. We think it gives a nice, good character to the car. Anyway, so we open her up, heaps of room in here, which is great. We actually just did a massive shop, so this is packed full. Um, but anyway, close her up. There's actually no beers in here, believe it or not. There probably should, but Nathan just keeps drinking them all. So there's not much you can steal. There's no beers, so <laughs> anyway. You come over here, we've got three drawers. So we keep all of our cooking stuff in this drawer, um, some more stuff in here, probably pots and pans in here. Bit of pots and pans, some Tupperware containers, and then up top we just keep some spare storage, like sheets and you just see bits and bobs, nothing really important. But it's good to have these three storage drawers. They just have so much room in them. They're super deep, so we can compact a lot of stuff in them and still easily be able to access everything out of them as well. Now, don't get overwhelmed. There's a lot of switches, but they're all really important, and I'm going to show you what they're for. First of all, interior lights. We've got our interior lights in here. Amazing. We've got some party lights that Corf Road have installed for us. We love our party lights, so we had to have them in. <laughs> Now we've got two switches here that say pantry light and table light. So I'm going to show you exactly what these lights are for. It's pretty amazing. So come over here. You see this big old thing. What we're going to do, we're going to pull her out. And this is our kitchen. So pull these out. Get her down. Now, like I said, we did a massive shop. So we've packed everything in there. We have so much food, probably more than what we actually need. Now, pantry lights. Oops. Pantry lights are in here. You can't really see it at the moment, but they're little light strips that go through here. So at night when you're cooking, these are great. You'll be able to see everything in here. And then you've also got table lights, which is in here. Once again, hard to see, but this pretty much just lights up your entire cutlery drawer. So your cutlery drawer is here. Heaps of room in here. We've got four dividers. Ooh. One of my coffee pods has gone flying. We've got four dividers here where you can split your cutlery and then we keep all of our like utensils and knives and everything up here. So it's really great, super, lots of room in there as well. Now, if you're wondering, yes, I do love my coffee. So we have dedicated this whole section to coffee, but you probably could utilize it for a lot more, but I didn't want to. It is daytime, so you can't see the LED lights, but they are really, really great. At nighttime, they light up the whole canopy. They are awesome. We've also got some work lights here, which are at the back of the canopy. And then you've got your water pump and your stereo. So we just switch that, the stereo turns on, switch the water pump, the water pump's on. It's really, really good. I'm just going to quickly put this up again. Oh, and before I forget to mention, you've also got another cupboard in here. We've just got our plates and bowls and stuff and some spare milk because we love our coffees in the morning once again. So yeah, that's where we keep all that. Um, alrighty, so this little Energive dial here actually shows us how much power we have left in our canopy. So we upgraded our electricity. We decided to go with one lithium battery at 200 amps and we have a 2000 watt inverter as well. So it's really, really great. We've actually got the solar panels on the roof charging this right now. So it's pretty much at 100%. Charges really, really well. It's super efficient, so we're loving it at the moment. Over here is our water dial. So it's actually at 70 litres at the moment. We've just filled our tanks up, so we haven't used any water today. Um, and at the moment, our inverter is on. I'll probably turn that off because we're actually not using it. We usually keep these things off, so. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much it. So when we want to turn our inverter on, we just power this up. When we want to look at our water, we just click this. And when we want to check how much electricity we have, we just click this. You can actually see the ampage as well from the solar panel. So yeah, Core Road has made this super, super easy for us and anybody else with the GDU canopy. It's literally just a click of a button and you know. So yeah, we're super stoked about that. And you guys will be as well. Come follow me over here. We've also got this travel buddy oven here that comes standard in the canopies. These are great. You chuck dinner in on the way to a campsite and it's cooked by the time you're at the campsite. So we absolutely love this. It runs off 12 volt as well. So you don't need to worry about your inverter. Now to my favorite side of the canopy. So once again, we unclip these here and we pull this bad boy down. So this is where our sink and our chopping board are. So we're pretty much Got a chopping board in here which pops out 
put that there and we just keep it we just keep it up here but this sink actually pops out and fits perfectly in here so when you're ready to chop your veggies wash your veggies or you want to do the dishes you just pull this down you plumb it all up so you've got hoses under here as well which i can pull out super super easy now these are your hoses you've got your hot and your cold so if you've connected your hot water system you just plug it in and it's all ready to go otherwise um, if you don't have your hot water you can just plug in your cold put your water tank on sorry put your water pump on and your water's ready to go so it's super easy and then once you're done unplug it and then it just goes back up underneath here once again super easy to pack up core off-road have done an amazing job with making these can canopies look so minimal and they're super effortless and just a great canopy the space is utilized so well so we are very really we are very Sorry, it's on some pretty strong struts, so this thing's not gonna go anywhere. Alrighty guys, if you love that side, you're gonna love this side as well. I'll open her up. Got heaps of room in here as well, which is awesome. Anyway, so you've got three drawers, which is where we keep all of our clothes. Nice and deep drawers, so we're able to fit a ton of stuff in there. Um, we also fit all our cam chairs in here. We've got a few fishing gear, we've got a fire pit. Um, yeah, it all fits in here really, really nicely. Got a sub in here too, which is great. Um, if you come over here, this is where the hot water systems are. So these hot water systems come standard in the GDU canopies and they're amazing. So it's on some really strong magnets, so it's not going to come out while you're driving and bump around, which is really, really good. But pretty much you swing around, you've got some hoses that they give you and you plug it all in for your gas and everything and then swing out your shower bracket and your shower tent. Everything goes straight in and you can have the best shower in less than a minute. It heats up so quickly. We absolutely love it. So I've tucked it back away. I'm going to close this canopy up and show you the shower bracket that they've installed with the canopy. Alrighty, so up here is the Cora Fred shower bracket. So you can pretty much chuck any shower tent of your choice up here. Click this button. If you're short like me, sometimes you just have to jump up on the wheel and pull it out yourself. It's exactly what I'm going to do. Alrighty, now that we've got the shower awning up, pretty much you unzip her, she comes out in a big square and then, as I said, open this up, that shower, hot water system swings out right here and you can plug all your hoses in, your shower tap and everything and it's just so, so easy. Alrighty guys, if you follow me just over here, they also have interior lights on this side, which is great if it's the middle of the night and you need to grab something from here, you can really easily. We've also got some USB ports, 12 volt, which I was charging my phone on. I don't know where I've put that though. And you've got some more down here as well. So four USB ports in total. You've also got a 12 volt cigarette lighter hole in there too. And some party lights. <laughs> Now, if you're wondering where we get our gas from for our hot water system, I'll show you exactly where it is. So behind this little cupboard door, two stir open. Core of Road have professionally put this one in for us. It's been installed well, signed off by their plumbers that they've got there. Um, but yeah, pretty much the gas runs from this four and a half kilo bottle right through under there and then there's a little valve on the outside where we plug in our gas hose and then straight into the hot water system. So it's super, super easy. I would definitely recommend getting something like this. It just makes life a whole lot easier. Alrighty, so that's this side of the canopy done. There's just one more thing I want to show you on the canopy. It's actually at the back. So come along with me and I'll show you. So at the back, we've actually got another drawer. We really, really wanted another drawer just to have some extra stuff in here. We weren't sure what we're going to put into it, but we know it's pretty handy, especially when you've got the awning out and stuff. If you want to cook around this side, you can as well. I'll show you what I mean. So you open her up, open that up, and that pretty much just opens up and you can put some more storage in there. Um, at the moment, we've just got a couple bags and we usually put our drifter table in there but you can literally put whatever you want in there fishing gear maybe would be a good idea but you can also put your cooktop on here and cook some food which is really really great as well 
for. So we decided to go with the off road ladder as well. This one's really, really good. It's mounted straight onto the back of the canopy. So you pretty much unlock that one. It comes down like this. It's super, super sturdy. We decided to go with this one. It's just a lot easier to be able to get into your tent and not pull a different ladder out of your car. We wanted it installed on our car. So that's what we went and head and did. Super great and I'm super glad we did it as well. Honestly worth it. We've also had our spare wheel installed on the back of our car as well. We just really like the look of it and it's a good place to keep your wheel. Now, just while I'm here, I'm gonna let you know that we will be doing a whole nother video mentioning all the other accessories on our car. So stay tuned for that video. Now guys, if you're questioning getting one of the Core Off-Road GDU canopies, go and get one. They are seriously unbeatable. And I'm gonna tell you exactly why we think they're unbeatable and why we have traveled for one of these canopies. When we were researching our canopies, we did a lot of research. We were looking up brands all over Queensland, which is where we were from, all through Vic, which is where our family was from, and we decided to go with this company in Perth. Now, the reason we loved the Cora Fro canopies, first of all, is the minimal look behind them. Everything is hidden, everything looks nice, everything is flush. You can't see any of the batteries. It's just a really, really nice looking canopy. The whole canopy is super, super organized, and I bet you can all agree with me as well. The next reason, effortless. It is so effortless. Everything is just unclipped. You just have to unlock these drawers to pull them out. Your battery system's here, your water system's there. We don't have to do anything. It is all done for us, and we absolutely love that about the Core Off Road Canopies. Another thing we love is that there's central locking all through the canopy. Super easy at night. You just lock your car and the whole canopy locks. You don't have to worry about coming up and locking all the doors. It's all done for you. Once again, effortless. It's so, so easy. Another thing with the Core Off Road Canopies, when you're deciding to go with one of them, they do a dual color. So you can match the color to your car as well, which is really, really great. So our car is graphite, and we went with the PPF wrap. So the outside of the canopy also has that graphite PPF wrap. So it is matched to our car and it looks absolutely awesome. This is also graphite up here as well. So it looks great. Everything is nice. And once again, very a very nice minimal sleek look to it, which we love. The team at Core Off Road are so, so good. They organize everything for us. They installed all the accessories for us, which once again, we're going to go through in another video. But the whole team there was so, so great. We absolutely loved working with them and getting the canopy done with them. Um, we obviously wouldn't recommend anyone else. Um, still. After having this done, still wouldn't recommend anyone else. We are so, so glad we drove all the way to Core Off Road at Perth to have this done. I still can't find another canopy better than this. Like, even driving around and looking at other people's, we <laughs> everyone loves this canopy. I tell you what, she gets a lot of attention. So, and if you guys see us on the road and you want to come say hi and have a look at the canopy, please do. Please come show. We love showing people the canopy and all the accessories in person. I'll tell you what, guys. I've said it once and I'll say it again, this is a great canopy. We are so, so stoked with this canopy. I can't even, like, what else can I say about it, honestly? <laughs> and before I forget to mention, as I was saying before, everything is nice and hidden. Um, you can't see anything. So our batteries and our inverters are actually behind these drawers. So even when I pull these drawers out, like you're not gonna be able to see the batteries or anything. I can't even see up there, I'm a bitch, I'm a shorty. I'll open this one, but even if you open these drawers up, you're not going to see anything so good. It's all hidden. You pull these out. You just can't, you can't see any like of the little hidden things like the bolts and the rails and stuff for the drawers. Like it's all hidden behind the canopy. Like you're not going to see any of it. So we absolutely love that. It's literally a home on wheels. You can't get better than this guys. You cannot get better. Make sure you go follow Core Off Road on Instagram and like and subscribe to their YouTube channel. They post heaps of walkthroughs of their builds and other things like cooking and stuff in the Travel Buddy ovens. You'll absolutely love their YouTube, so definitely go check it out. And yeah, if you have any other questions about the GTU canopies, definitely hit us up and ask us. We are happy to answer anything. We will always be honest with you guys and there's nothing bad we can say about it anyway. So definitely hit us up, guys. We hope you enjoyed this video today and we hope you loved the run through of our canopy. If you want to see the build reveal, definitely head to our YouTube channel. The reveal's up there on our YouTube channel. So watch that. You'll love that one as well. <laughs> They're all pretty great. Um, so yeah, that's all for now, guys. Stay tuned for our next video on the accessories and we'll catch you next time. Bye.